What's going on everybody? I'm Jackson Taylor and today we are going to be talking about grubs. So we were digging a trench and we actually found all these guys while we were digging it. And we're digging this for a sprinkler pipe for the rest of our plants. But that's just what we found digging this. And what's kind of funny is the girls love to eat them. What? The girls in our family? Yeah. They actually really like them. What? Yeah. So, also, um, they are beneficial for your soil. For one, they decompose all the wood chips and all that. And just look stuff. at our soil. So we put, we've put wood chips down for years. And that's dug, you know, about eight inches deep, maybe a little more. And it's nice brown soil, all because of earthworms and grubs. Not that disgusting clay soil. What's also interesting about the about grub? Oh yeah, number two is their poop can also be good for your plants. And the plants will eat it. But it can be harmful to some types of grass. But we don't have that problem. So if you have them, just keep them in your yard. Yeah. So a lot of people are afraid that <coughs> these grubs will. Hey dog, let me get you. These grubs will actually hurt the. Uh, the native the native trees and plants in your yard these are decomposers they're not looking for live roots the only types of roots that they'll eat like jackson said is grass roots because they're soft and tender but this this line is across all of our trees that we're we're digging our sprinkler line in and we have not had any problem with them eating the roots the roots still look healthy they're happy the trees are doing well and so we're not super concerned about any of that so what we're gonna do now since I guess the girls like to eat them mm -hmm. we're gonna we're gonna take them to the girls and and let them chow down and you guys can enjoy watching the girls eat these grubs so as you can see there's a bunch of different stages in here too like there's brand new ones there's a bunch of bigger ones medium-sized ones but this one right here is as you can see it's starting to turn into a beetle Cause that's what Weird. happens to grubs. I did look these up a little bit and they're actually scarab beetles. There's a pretty cool link that I'll try to put in the description. You guys can read about it from the University of Arizona, how they're not bad for your garden. So there's a lot of people that think they are and they're wrong. Okay. So we'll, uh, we'll now go feed the, feed yeah. these to the girls. Let's go feed them. And walk away. Just sprinkle them right down there. See, the girls love them. <laughs> what laugh was that? And that's the ones that came last aren't going to get as much. Yeah, because almost all of them are gone. They love them so much. like you a little more now. Are they all gone? Oh, that one? They're having trouble getting that one that was trying to get to a deal. That's awesome. Alright, so the ladies ate it just like we said. We didn't lie to you. Might have deceived you a little bit. But the girls in our family just ate them up and loved them. So, we're gonna, we're gonna we're gonna round them up, try to get them back the dog, inside. The dog gets them round. The dog, the dog does love to round them up. We'll see. He's like our little shepherd dog. Oh, they know he's coming. They know he's coming. Get him, Murph. Get him in there. <laughs> All right, guys. So we got our little shepherd dog out here trying to round him up. He doesn't usually hurt him though. Sometimes he's not as helpful as we'd like, but it's better than us chasing after him. So if you like our videos. Please subscribe and we'll continue to bring more content and see you next time. Bye.